I may be Mufin Man. I may be. Who knows? All right. Is everyone ready? All right. So, this is going to be patch analysis for 1.1.6. Thank God. A new patch. A new day. They have fixed the GDPR timer. It used to be glitched where you could refresh it every 15 days, but it was grayed out and you couldn't do it um, after the 15 day mark. So they fixed it. So now you can update whenever I think. I hope. Uh, we'll try it out after this. Um, they added a new emote. We'll also check that out. Can't wait. Quality of life. They fixed the additional ability feedback when an extra info option is enabled. Some of them never showed up, while others always showed up. The additional ability feedback when the extra info option is enabled. Is this like when somebody dies and three and three people of the same guy shows up or something? I wish they were more like explain this more. Additional ability feedback. They changed the probe icon again. <laughs> I wonder if they went back to the ham. King's name in chat is now Golden. Oh my god. Your target was immune. They could have been drunk, enforcer, merc, sellsword, prince, invoker, alcoholic. Oh. Is that what this is? That's nice. Golden King name sounds like it could be hard to see. Interest to see what it looks like. Yeah, no, I'm uh, kind of interested as well. Improved feedback for heal, debauchery, and strings of Mithras when tips are on. Improved feedback. Okay. We'll uh, we'll check this out. I'm not sure if this means that when you get healed, you'll now get told if you were healed by two people or one person. Which would be nice. I'm assuming when you debotch somebody and they're immune, it'll tell you why they possibly could be immune. Because it was very like, if a butler occupied somebody and then you tried to debotch, it would say they were immune. Or they were immune or occupied, but like a lot of people wouldn't actually see the occupied button and then they would claim them Oc immune and they would kill them. So I hope that this kind of like um, fixes things. Um, private notes are darker. Private notes are darker. Okay. Uh, we'll check this out in game. Revamped report backend. This took some time, but it will allow us to more quickly and better handle reports. Okay, this is good. Trying to ban more toxicity in the game and just like game throwers, I suppose. General. Reworded the definition of Occupy Immune and Death Immune. Reworded the definition. I guess we'll check this out. Reworded Occupy Immune Passives. Starting King abilities got reworked. Awesome. Wonderful. Okay. So we'll check uh, we'll check these out as well. Minor ability changes. Alchemist. Stone skin reduced to three uses. So now you actually have to... You can't just be like, I'm Alchemist and then stone skin for four days and then the game's over. You actually have to think about how you want to use your stone skins. 
space them out. Possibly bait, you know. So... You could probably kill an alchemist in the end game if you play your cards right. So that they can't decide the end winner. Which is nice. I like that. Court Wizard can now use clear mind at all points during the day. Wonderful. I've had so many times where a paladin or a sheriff would find an unseen or a cult member and we would vote them up like as soon as possible and then I can't clear mind them because... You can't clear mine in the middle of an execution or middle of a vote. And then you're like, well, shit. So, this is a, a very good change. I like this. Um, I guess they're still testing out the empower ability in the swaps. And I, they think that it's fine for now. But who, who knows? Maybe in the next patch they'll change. Or they'll tweak up the abilities of Court Wizard. Kind of a strange class right now, but... Uh, I'm liking it so far. Enforcer. Frenzy now has two uses. You know what would be cool is if two for one also had two uses. Ho! Oh, I think that would be too broken actually. Um, Two uses. So uh, I guess that you can frenzy kill the king right away. And then once you find the prince or the prince outs himself, you can now two for one and kill the prince and somebody else. Inquisitor and Scorn loses death immunity when they achieve their objective. Thank the Lord. <laughs> we can now kill Scorns and Inquisitors once they won so they don't decide the end game as well. I really dislike... The Scorn and Inquisitor who win and decide the game because they can't die. I mean, the Inquisitor can, but if you're BD and the Inquisitor side's evil or something, I don't know. It's just... It's difficult. So, thank God. I like this. Psycho King's Fatal Guards icon has changed. Alright, so we'll check that out. Alright, the moment we've been waiting for. Major class ability changes. King. Now has separate class cards for each king. Oh, thank Jesus. Because every time you would try and look at what the king can do um, in the player class cards, it would be a neutral king. So you wouldn't actually see it. Now you can actually look at each individual good psycho. I mean, you could always see psycho king. This is more for evil and good king and neutral king. Order execution has been removed. Uh, for those that you don't know, um, one of the devs came to my channel one day when they uh, removed uh, find allies or something. And they had find allies and guard. And then they removed find allies. And I'm not sure what they added. I don't even know if they even gave him something else but i was i made the suggestion of since the king can't find allies give him something to kill people with and the next patch they added order execution so i suggested that but now they have removed it only good king now starts with two extra guards okay does that go back up to six Or is it still five? So does that mean that the evil king will only have three guards? Good king now has a new knight ability called swear fealty. It makes a player immune to conversion permanently. Wow, I like it. I like it. Okay, okay. So you can just swear fealty like a paladin or a sheriff and it's GG. That's strong. I like that. Evil King has a new ability called Allies. It informs you if a player is cult or unseen. Four uses. Okay, now the Evil King gets find allies. I like it. Okay. 
now the king can actually find out who his evils are. This is a really good change, and I'm excited to play this in-game. This is very nice. Um, I'm not sure how the Whisper meta is going to be for King now. The it's still the same percentages, 65 and 35. Um, 35 being Evil King. But the King only has 3 guards and 4 ally checks. Whereas the Good King has 5 guards and 1 swear fealty. Okay, I like it. King changes are really nice. These are these are good. Position and herbalist. Herbalist, sorry. Added a new day ability called Exhume. At the end of the night, it will inform you what killed the player. They re they brought this back. Why would an herbalist need Exhume? But it's a day ability, so I guess it doesn't really matter nice for finding the neutral killer type I, I guess yeah that makes sense ritualist added a new day ability called exhum at the end of the night you'll inform you what killed the player one use so ritualist gets one use of it and a physician gets three uses but why i mean I, okay okay I'll, I'll give it to him sure why not You can check if it was a Prince Exy. I mean, it's sure. <laughs> Support investigate. They didn't. They didn't change um, the quality of life or like general. But it would be pretty cool if physician was classified as support investigate. I'm not sure if that would actually come up, but uh, if it does, that'd be pretty cool. But they didn't mention it. Alright. Um, let's check out the player cards. So, Cult King. Let me, uh, let me move my camera for this. Alright, there we go. Okay. So that's the Cult King. The Good King. For a fealty. Three guards. Okay, so it is it is five guards, confirm. Um neutral king. Only gets three guards. I can see that, okay. Makes sense. Psycho King. You are death immune. Huh. And unseen king. Find allies counts as visiting, so you can get caught doing it. Oh, so the observer can actually follow the king and kill the king right away. Oh my god. I have come up with the most genius fool strategy. Observer follow king. Right? And you would... You would see the king visit somebody. You could also gossip. You could claim noble and gossip somebody and just claim that um, allies has been used on that person. And then you kill the king for being evil. And then when the king is dead and you're and it's your time to step up, you're a noble claim who didn't step up and you get executed. That is so smart. Oh. They didn't tell us that they changed the fool icon, but this is new. They didn't mention that they changed the fool icon. What if Prince kills you for lying first? What if you do it day two? Is that the troll box? Okay, let's look at the uh, probe. Is that Marshall? Now it's King Finger? What the hell? <laughs> Go back to the ham. Go back to the ham. <laughs> oh 
Why is it the king finger? Or the pants. I like the pants. Okay. Was that it? Um. Next thing is the emote, right? Oh my god, they added a fucking dab. Are you... I'm done. I'm not playing this game anymore. What is wrong with them? They ruined a perfectly good game of social deduction with a... With a dab! Why? Who does this? Oh my god. Tilted. If I'm Prince and I see somebody with that emote, I'm executing them. No, no questions asked. Don't you dare buy that emote. Oh, it's elbow sniffing. Okay, yeah, sure. Perfectly smelling inner elbow will grant miracles today. Well, not everyone in the realm is superstitious. You can't be too careful. Yeah, because the prince is going to execute you in jail. I didn't want to hear it. <sighs> Alright, was that it? I think that was it. Yep. All right. Oh yeah, the last thing I want to do is request data. And then um, I can check it out. Okay, let's see. What have we here? Where's my win rates? Um, physician. Wait. My right, next. Okay. We have played 198 physician games. We have won 117 of them and lost 96. That's still not accurate. That's, that's, that's still not accurate. Alchemist. We have played 84 Alchemist games. We have won 65 and lost 21. <laughs> uh, wait. Templar? It's a soul catcher and a Templar. What are these? Who are you? What do you want from me? Old classes? Yeah, seems like it. We have won six sort games and lost 12. We have... 127 Inquisitor and lost four. <laughs> oh my god, what about Reaper? Where's Reaper at? Wait, Fool. Fool and Scorn. Those are the ones that I want to see. We have 116 Fool and lost 13. I don't think these are accurate. And then Scorn. We have 124 and lost 12. All right. Let's look at our total games and then let's let's start playing some. Um We have won 1233 games and we've lost 795. But we have played almost 3000 games. We have played 2,872 games. I have received 57 reports. 
and I've only been banned once for 24 hours for being toxic, but that was like the first month of playing this game when I got I did a drunk stream, so you know, I was, I was being a little rude. And I've had one warning. 57 reports for being so good. So good. Alright, Mastermind. I want to check Mastermind and Prince. We have played 100 Mastermind games. We have won 64 and lost 46. Okay. And Prince. Princess. Alright, we have played 124 Prince games. We have won 88 and lost 39. These don't really count. Like, I mean, they don't really match. Because I've played almost 3,000 games and it only says I've won like 1,300 and lost 800, so. Alright. That does it for patch analysis 1.1.6. I hope you guys enjoyed my thought process and what I think they did well on okay let's move on sorry if i didn't uh, call you out or say hi to any of you uh 